Week after the El Paso ISD voted to change the name of Robert E. Lee Elementary School, tomorrow El Paso City Council could vote to rename Robert E. Lee Road. Now, this road stretches from Gateway West to Montana near Airway over in East El Paso. KTSM 9 News reporter Selena Quintana is live with the details. The intersection behind me has the road Robert E. Lee, which was named after a general in the Confederate Army during the Civil War. But starting tomorrow, city council could actually begin the process of changing the name. This actually is not the first time council will discuss the topic. As KTSM previously reported, back in 2017, El Pasoans proposed the idea of changing the Robert E. Lee street name when racial tensions flared up after protest, one protester was killed during a Charlottesville demonstration. And in 2014, part of the Robert E. Lee Road and Fort Bliss Gate were renamed to Buffalo Soldier Road, which was commemorating the 1817 expedition by all African American 9th Calvary. Track 1 Restaurant is a business along Robert E. Lee Road, and we spoke with the co owner who says she agrees with the name change. No, oh, we're okay with it. My husband uh, agreed to it because he's ex military, and so we support the Buffalo Soldiers and their, uh, their history and what they did, and so we were okay. But if it had been for another name that maybe we weren't so happy with. Uh, we had uh, talked about seeing if they would uh, name it after the track one, track one Boulevard. I mean, it's been here for so long, so it would be nice to have it have its own name. The agenda item comes almost a week after the EPISD board approved to rename Robert E. Lee Elementary. Again, El Paso City Council will vote on whether to change the, the road's name tomorrow. Now, for more updates, you can go ahead and look. Stay tuned online and on air with KTSM. Live in East El Paso, Selena Quintana, KTSM 9 News. Thank you, Selena.